the 2024 again brings an election year, we get to spend our dollars on our beliefs if if that's what you choose to do. Some of us more than others, right? Have you ever spent your dollars politically? I I try to consciously spend. Your dollar please. I don't always know what companies, what organizations are aligned with which political parties because they do a good job at keeping that low key and, and a the, lot. And the reality is, bro, all companies kind of dabble in both because they realize that America is just a two-party system and, you know, you got to work with Democrats and the Republicans <laughs> when they're in power. But... You know, another interesting way to spend your dollar, and some people do it, again, more than others, is through merch. You know, we see political merch all the time. Obama's yet, Yes We Can, you know, stickers. And mm-hmm. I've never spent my dollars on that. Yeah, no, I don't have any Obama shirts or anything like that. I don't have anything that says Go Brandon either. You know what I'm saying? Like Go who? We have some pretty interesting, uh, I guess, marketing strategies from some familiar faces and then there's this as donald trump's legal bills continue to mount he literally is selling the suit off of his back to make more money you may remember last year the former president announced a digital trading card collection featuring these images of him as george washington crossing the delaware a wwe champion well now trump is back with what he's calling the mugshot edition of those cards, featuring a very special deal for a limited time only. For the first time, we're creating a real physical Trump card. Purchase 47 digital cards and we'll mail you a beautiful trading card. It is an authentic piece of the suit I wore when I took that now famous mugshot. And it was a great suit, believe me, a really good suit. It's all cut up, and you're going to get a piece of it. I wish I looked as good as I do on those cards. That I can tell you. They give me muscles where, believe me, I don't have them. I wanted to keep (laughs) my Trump Digital trading cards at the same price, $99 each. Collect your own exclusive piece of American history, and we'll all have fun together. Have a good life. <laughs> Why do I feel like this is like one of those collective quarter commercials you see like back in the day when you're watching late night television, you know? So 98% of NFTs have dropped to the value of zero. That's what Gary V was saying. It was like 90% of this is going to shit. <laughs> <laughs> so if you want to buy 47 of these trading cards, excuse me. If you want to buy 47 of these wonderful Trump trading cards, <laughs> you know, feel free to do so. That's your right as an American. That's the beauty of this country, right? Like, Hey, and it says only $99. Hey, bro, Trump is a hell of a marketer, bro. Like, yeah, he is. We can't, like, as much <sighs> as you may agree or disagree with his politics. Bro, I know this man was not in the boat as George Washington. <laughs> Bro, this cat was sitting in... Bro, he turned himself into Barbie, bro. This guy does everything. (laughs) In the chair of Abraham Lincoln Memorial. Bro, look at this guy. He's a a soldier coming out of the the, the rubble. This guy turned into a fucking storm. This guy Shazam in a suit. Like, bro, what are we doing right now? This man is crazy. Bro. Bro, he said, he said, he said, (laughs) ChatGPT. Make me Abraham Lincoln. <laughs> Again, do whatever with your money that you want to do. Make 50 pictures of <laughs> Donald Trump being the most powerful people in the world, especially the U.S. So you buy 47 of these cards, you get a piece of the suit that he wore in the mugshot. A very nice suit. Pieces of a very nice suit. <laughs> Two Face. Like that, he he said very nice. He didn't say just the suit, right? Do you think that's going to be like some heirloom that's passed down from generation to generation? Bro, it's going to be one of those things that, like, fifty years down the road, the KKK is going to cherish a lot. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's going to be one of those things like we've like the Catholics be having like the chalice that <laughs> Jesus drank out of at the Last Supper and shit, the shroud yeah. that this is Jesus's face right here. I got the last trump. <laughs> <laughs> bro hey get, get get your get your shit now especially when he goes to prison 
It's going to be like Manhunt. It's banned game, banned suit. Again, very creative marketing. He's peddling pieces of his suit. This, How broke is he? I mean... Or is he just a hustler? No, I mean, he has billions of dollars on paper. What are you talking about, bro? Billion, uh, billions of dollars on paper. Right. It's all about to get seized. Mm-hmm. Hey, we need it right now. U.S. need as much as we can get, bro. What do you think of the Trump trading cards? Are you guys going to invest? Is this the new wave of political funding that we're going to be able to invest into? <laughs> Is this, this is the future of American politics, all, you know, brought in by number 47. You feel me? Please like, share, and subscribe. <laughs> Too generic, not this bullshit. <laughs> See you guys later. Live good, be good. Have a good life. Bye.